Faux fever, nine millimeter. Demo want a heater cause the streets is finna heat up. Right now in my life, I definitely did not expect to see the world and make music for a living. My sound is really organic and kind of honest hip hop. You know, there's, there's times when it's aggressive, it's emotional, but it's really just lifestyle music. In this lifetime, some of them my partners, they don't believe in karma, but they believe in commas. And they believe they dollars for a peace of mind. Put a price up on their head and they be fine with that fine. Growing up for me in hip hop, my influences were everybody from, you know, Public Enemy, DJ Quick, E-40, to LL Cool J, Wu-Tang Clan, to Brand Nubian, like the whole gamut. I knew this is what I wanted to do when I was like in elementary school. You know, everybody back in the day was, was like trying to battle each other on the playground and it just started coming easy to me. What I want people to feel when they hear my music is all aspects of, of life, pain, joy, faith, hurt, excitement. So I've always seen music as a tool to communicate a, a message, to really connect with people. So for me, a lot of times the goal of success is connecting with people in a real way. What inspires me to, to bring it for my fans and, and live in the moment is their ferocious support. You know, obviously for every 10 good comments, it's one negative, but even the negative sometimes can, can push you to be, be a better artist or, or be better at what you do. Music matters to me because it's, it's, a, it's a language. It's a unique way to, to speak to a person in an emotional, spiritual, mental way that nothing else can. Them numbers in my bank account are no reason for living and sleeping with bad women really doesn't keep me driven. I'm sure this man Pepsi supports BET Music Matters. Pepsi, live for now.